Welcome to Mars headquarters. The journey begins here. Today we're looking at the Mars 13 XLD and I'll give you the lowdown on what the LD stands for. Lowdown. <laughs> so you can fit that conveniently in your garage. A magnificent hybrid pop-up camper that's packed with luxury, great value. Can't wait to show you. Let's start with the front of the van. We've got one of the best hitches on the market. It's the Cruise Master DO35. And we've got an Anderson plug as standard. We've got the ARC XO 750 Series Extreme Off-Road Jockey Wheel. We've got three neat compartments at the front. LP gas storage on either side for nine kilo gas cylinders. The middle compartment, we've got two 20 litre jerry can holders. The driver's side gas storage is fitted with a gas regulator. Now we'll show you the door side of the van. So conveniently placed above the roll-out fridge slide, we have a LED light with bug light. The slide-out fridge comes with an extractor fan. And this is just so easy to set up. Look at that, perfect for a 95 litre fridge. We've got additional storage here for your condiments. Put your cocktail drinks there. So convenient and easy to set up. We've got outdoor speakers that are waterproof, so you can boogie all night under the stars. This door is so good. It comes with a protector over your vent, so you won't get any dust inside the van. Love that. Your door has a fly screen. Just perfect. Just close that. And I'll pack up this fridge slide, which is as easy to pack up as it was to set up. Let's see what else the Mars 13 has to offer. Your second waterproof speaker, your entertainment system, or your inputs, outputs, antenna, everything you need, TV bracket. So Mars understands how important your outdoor dining is, and it's so easy to set up. Wait till you see this slide out kitchen. Look at this. Any chef's gonna love this. So we've got a dish rack, we've got a sink, hot and cold water, four gas burners, so you'll be able to cook for the masses. Look at that, we've got these windshields, and we've got this huge cutlery drawer, some more storage space in here. We'll just close this rack. We can open this up and we've got this fantastic pantry. Look at that, and we can expand on that with more storage. And there's a recess here that has got space for another chopping board to slide in. Look at that. We've got an electrical awning that only takes 20 seconds to set up. Now we'll check out the rear of the van. At the rear of the van, we've got two mud terrain spare tires. We've got two reverse cameras and this compartment comes out. So it's so easy to set up your king bed. Wait and see. So the bed expansion, so easy to set up. We just unbuckle a few latches, pull the tires down. Simple as that. Now we'll set up the bed when we go inside, but before we do that, let's check the other side of the van. We've got your water inlets, including your main water inlet. We've got this really convenient external shower, perfect for washing the dog or yourself after a long day at the beach. And that comes with an ensuite. We've got an LED light with a bug light. We can check on the kids while you're having a shower. How good's that? We've got a 15 amp power inlet. We've got another water inlet. We've got these fantastic looking red rockers to protect your van. 16 inch mud terrain tires. We've got your cassette. We've got some more storage up here. Look at that, huge. Under that, we've got another slide. Really convenient for your generator. Thought of everything, Mars. Now it's time to check the interior of the van. Before we go into the interior, I'll quickly pop up the roof. So easy to do, I'll show you. Four easy latches. And then it's just a matter of going in and popping it up. It's like bench pressing one kilo, so easy. Okay, now that we've popped up the roof, it's time to finish off fixing up the bed. As simple as rolling the mattress out. And look at that. We're done on the bed and it is so comfortable. We've got LED reading lights on either side. We've got USB plugs. We've got ample storage. We've got fans either side for those hot nights. And of course, you'll be watching Netflix in bed with this adjustable 
TV. Bed light, night light, everything at your disposal from your bed. So cozy, you'll be watching movies on those long rainy days. So we've got this really comfortable couch. We've got controls for your aircon. Below the couch, you can see we've got even more USB plugs. And moving up here, we've got a switch for the exhaust fan and the shower light belt. Now moving over to the other side, let's check out the fridge. So we've got a Dometic fridge, 60 litre, or a fridge of your choosing. And look at this, your control panel. We've got your projector panel to monitor your hot and cold water and your battery power. Universal control panel to control all your lighting, your TV, your water pump. Next to that, we have the inverter controller. Below this, we have a switch for your awning. This is your Truma hot water system control panel. And of course, your media system. And one of the best things about the control panel, you can download your PM400 app and everything can be controlled from here. So if you take off in the car and you've left something on, you pull over and just simply hit that switch. One of the things I love about this interior is the fine finish. So next to the fridge, we have this huge storage compartment and another one above it. And on those miserable cold nights, we can cook inside with this internal kitchen, two gas cookers, a sink with hot and cold water and some more bench space here to chop up some veggies. We've got some places to store some drinks and some more storage on either side. We've got this really neat separate ensuite that's got plenty of space with your toilet. We've got an adjustable shower and of course a sink with hot and cold water. Just so convenient, so neat, just perfect. The Mars 13 XLD, just magnificent. I'm sure you enjoyed it. Perfect little pop-up camper for families. If you're interested to know more, please go to marscampers.com.au.